Hello friends, welcome to Engineering Funda family. In this video, I'll explain you virtual shot and virtual ground concept in operational amplifier. Using this concept, in future we will be solving so many problems. So first of all, you need to understand what is virtual shot. See, virtual shot means we are having two terminals at same potential. Let us say we have terminal A and terminal B. And as if both of these terminals are having same potential, then you can say virtually both of these terminals are short. So virtual short means what? Virtual short means if two terminals are at the same potential without being in contact with each other, then those two points are virtual short. With operational amplifier, let me explain you how this virtual short concept is there. See, with operational amplifier, here we have two input terminals, V in minus and V in plus. As per ideal operational amplifier characteristics, you can say V in plus and V in minus are virtually short. Let me explain you how. Here, if you observe, we have operational amplifier. If I say this operational amplifier is having gain AD, then what is my output? My output has to be, my output has to be this differential gain AD into differential input. This differential input is how much? V in plus minus V in minus, right? Or you can say V out that is AD into VD, where VD is differential input. See, with ideal operational amplifier, this differential gain AD that has to be infinite, right? And if you wanted to have AD is equals to infinite, then there are two cases. See what is AD? AD is AD is V out divided by VD. So to get AD is equals to infinite, one way is to have V out is equals to infinite. So if you have V out is equals to infinite, you can have AD is equals to infinite. And if you wanted to have differential gain is equals to infinite, then second way is to have VD is equals to zero. So if you have VD is equals to zero, then also you can have differential gain, which will be infinite, right? Now see, if you talk about first case, if you talk about first case, V out is equals to infinite, then do you think like V out is equals to infinite that is possible? But obviously no, you see, if you observe transfer characteristics, then output voltage of op-amp that is having positive saturation and negative saturation. Positive saturation that is there somewhere below the value of VCC and negative saturation that is there somewhere below minus VEE. So you cannot have V out that is equals to infinite. So this first possibility that is not possible, right? So you cannot have V out is equals to infinite. So let us talk about second possibility. So in second possibility, if VD is equals to zero, VD is V in plus minus V in minus, right? So you can say V in plus minus V in minus that is equals to zero. What it means V in plus that is equals to V in minus means here you observe we have, we have this two input that is there at same potential to have infinite differential gain, right? So this is what virtual short at input of op-amp, right? So that is how this basic concept is there. So to get differential gain is equal to infinite, virtual short means what? V in plus and V in minus both will be having same potential, right? That is what the basic concept which we are assuming for ideal op-amp. But practically what happens? See, practically, practically this differential gain, practically this differential gain, that is 10 to the power 6. So as this differential gain, that is 10 to the power 6 practically, you can say this V in plus and V in minus that cannot be equal, right? And as differential gain is there in terms of 10 to the power 6, you can say this differential voltage, which is V in plus minus V in minus, 
right which is v in plus minus v in minus that is there in terms of micro voltage right because of differential gain is not infinite right so here how to have how to have virtual short concept so to have virtual short concept what we will be doing is we will be providing negative feedback i have already explained you what is negative feedback in my last video right see by having negative feedback what happens by having negative feedback see this is v out right this is v out that we are giving it in feedback over here so based on this here we have feedback voltage vf right and based on this here now with this amplifier we will be having differential output that is vd so what is vd now see vd now that is v in minus vf so because of feedback because of negative feedback see because of negative feedback my differential voltage that is decreasing and as it is decreasing you can say vd that is approaching towards zero right see it is already there in terms of micro voltage because of negative feedback it is decreasing and it is approaching towards zero if it is getting zero then what will happen if it is getting zero then you can say v in plus that will be equals to v in minus right so in negative feedback we can say v in plus is equals to v in minus and this is this is virtual short concept right and that is happening practically in negative feedback now see virtual ground concept means what see virtual ground concept means here in negative feedback if you keep v in plus grounded then v in minus that is also getting grounded like you see if i say here if i say here this terminal that i'm connecting it with ground then what we are doing we are providing v in plus that is equals to zero and as per virtual short concept v in plus is equals to v in minus so what will happen v in minus that is also getting zero so you can say this is also getting grounded so what it means if you ground positive terminal then negative terminal of input that is also getting ground so that is virtual ground concept of operational amplifier right so virtual short concept is what virtual short concept is two terminals are having equal potential to achieve infinite differential gain you can have two ways which i have told you one is by having v out is equals to infinite which is not possible second way is to have vd is equals to zero which makes your v in plus is equals to v in minus but practically this differential gain cannot be infinite it is there in terms of 10 to the power 6 so this differential voltage that will be there in terms of micro volt to get v in plus and v in minus at equal potential we can provide negative feedback if you provide negative feedback then this differential voltage at amplifier that will decrease because of negative feedback right and as it is decreasing it will be approaching towards zero if it is getting zero you can say v in plus is equals to v in minus that is virtual short concept and that we can apply it in negative feedback so what is virtual ground if you provide positive terminal of input with ground then automatically this negative terminal of input that is also getting grounded that is virtual ground concept and using this we will be solving so many examples in future coming videos i hope you have understood this still if anything that you would like to share please note it down in comment section i'll be happy to help you thank you so much for watching this video